Hey everyone, it's me Triton, and over the next few days, I'll be releasing videos to help you achieve a blazing sun for a few of the hunting ground trials in Horizon Zero Dawn. I'm a big advocate for attempting these without a guide at least a few times, as they are all very reasonable and self-explanatory. With that said, there was a few trials that gave me a little bit of trouble, and I often found that the stumbling blocks I was encountering related to the position of the enemies when I started, or not having an optimized loadout. The videos I went to to try to get some advice and tips seldom had commentary, and they never really explained the loadout choices or tactics used, and that would have been a really helpful thing to me, and that's why I'm making these videos. This first one covers the Watch Out Trial located at the Spurflins Hunting Ground designed for characters at least level 18. In this trial, you'll need to use the Silent Strike ability on 4 Watchers in under 2 minutes. Preparation is the key for this one, and as far as my loadout is concerned, I have the Nora Silent Hunter Heavy Suit equipped with modifications at increased stealth. And in terms of abilities that have helped me, I also have the Quiet Sprint ability unlocked, which allows me to run past enemies without being noticed. The timer will start the minute you slide down the rope, so you can see here that I am scanning and tagging 4 watchers before I slide down, and there are 5 in total. The reason I choose the farthest rope on the right is because there isn't a stalker in the immediate area like there is on the farthest rope to the left, and you can get the drop on the very first watcher right away. Keep in mind that you have to use the Silent Strike ability, which is R1, and not your bow from the tall grass. I tried that the first few times I did this, and I kept failing and I was confused as to why until I looked into the trial a little bit further, aka learn to read. It's best to get each watcher in a one-on-one -on -one situation in which you can sneak up from behind. And remember that the Silent Strike ability is an available option even when the exclamation point above their head is red, it will just alert the other machines at that point. You'll see as the video plays out that alerting the other watchers and some of the machines in the area actually works in my favor and I didn't have to traverse much of the zone to find the rest of them. You have two minutes to complete this trial, and while that seems like a long time, it really isn't depending on how far spread out the watchers are and having to navigate two total stalkers and at least four shell walkers in the same area. Don't try and call the watchers into the tall grass to use Silent Strike as that takes a lot of time and you probably can't afford to do that more than once. I also noticed that my tags would disappear at times which may be related to alerting the machines so watch out for that. This took me around 5 total attempts to complete, with the biggest keys to success being the initial preparation work I put in in terms of equipment and modifications, as well as tagging the watchers. Take cover in the tall grass as needed, and you should be able to finish this trial with around 20-30 to 30 seconds to spare. For my next video, I'll be doing two of the trials from the Sunburrows hunting grounds, but if you guys have any suggestions or videos that you would like me to do, please leave that in the comment section below, and I'll try to get to those as well. But until the next video, guys, thanks for watching and hope all of you have a great day.